Today, I'm going to show you how to subtract numbers. Sometimes we'll need to do something called borrowing. Sometimes we might not need to. I'm going to use a special sheet that's going to help you determine if you have to borrow or if you don't have to borrow. Let's do a problem. The first problem we're going to do is 99 minus 44. So you see here, we write numbers. And down here, we'll write our answers. And on top, we're going to make some tally marks. This is going to help us determine if we have to borrow or not borrow. So let's do it. So we have 9 minus 4. Can I do 9 minus 4? Let's check. So I'm going to make 9 tally marks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I need to take away 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. How many do I have left? I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I'm going to write 5 under here. Then we have 9 minus 4 again, so we know that's 5. So our answer is 55. Now let's say you weren't sure if you could do 9 minus 4. There's a sheet I've attached in this video right here. So I could go here and look for 9 minus 4. So I'm going to go to the minus 4s. So I see right here, 9 minus 4 is 5. So you have two ways now to figure out if you have to borrow or not. Let's do another one. Let's do 73 minus 47. Can I do 3 minus 7? Let's see. 1, 2, 3. So now I need to take away 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oops, I don't have enough. So what I need to do, I need to go next door and borrow. So I'm going to take 1 away from the 7, and the seven's not going to become a 6. And the 1 that I borrowed from the 6, I'm going to give it to the 3. And the 3 is going to become a 13. Now, I need to do 13 minus 7, so I can make 13 tally marks. So let me make my 13 tally marks. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So I need to do 13 take away 7. Let's see. Take away 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, Six, seven. How many am I left with? One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm left with six. So 13, take away seven, is six. Now I need to do six, take away four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now I need to take away four. One, two, three, four. I'm left with two. So 6 take away 4 is 2. So my answer is 26. And like I said before, we have 13 minus 7. If I don't know 13 minus 7, I could make the tally mark like I did up here, or I could go to this special sh sheet and find 13 minus 7. So let me find the minus 7s. So 13 minus 7 is 6. And if I didn't know 
six minus four, I can go to the special sheet. Let me go to the minus fours. So six minus four is two. Okay, let's do a few more, but I'm not gonna be using the special sheet. So I'm gonna do exactly three more. So let's do 65 minus 44. So can I do five minus four? One, two, three, four, five. Take away four. One, two, three, four. Yes, I'm left with one. Six, take away four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let me take away four. One, two, three, four. I'm left with two. The answer is 21. Let's do 94, take away 47. Can I do four take away seven? Let's see. One, two, three, four. No, I need to take away seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't have enough. So I need to go next door, take one away from the nine, and the nine is gonna become an eight. And the one that I borrowed from the nine, I'm gonna give it to the four. And the four becomes a 14. So now I need to do 14 minus seven. So I want you to find out what is 14 minus seven. You can make the tally marks up here, or you can use the special sheet. So go ahead and find out where 14 minus seven is, and then write your answer below. Okay, 14 minus seven is seven. Now we need to do eight minus four. So you can pause the video and find out what eight minus four is. You can make the tally marks here, or you can use the special sheet to find out what eight minus four is. Eight minus four is four. So our answer is 47. Let's do one more. We're going to do 70 minus 29. So we have zero take away nine. So if we have nothing, okay, we have absolutely nothing, okay? There's nothing in here. We can't take away nine from nothing. So we have to go next door and borrow. So the seven is gonna become a six and the one that I borrowed from the seven, I'm gonna give it to the zero. Now the new number is 10. So now find out how much is 10 take away nine. You can use the tally marks, or you can go to the special sheet. You can pause the video. 10 take away nine is one. Now we gotta do six take away two. How much is six take away two? You can use the space up here for your tally marks, or you can use the special sheet to find out the answer. You can pause the video. Six take away two is four. So our answer is 41. So use this sheet 
whenever you need to subtract. It'll be very helpful. See you next time.